to determine if light is needed for photosynthesis. Photosynthesis is a process in which plants use simple inorganic substance, water and carbon dioxide in the presence of light from the sun and chlorophyll to produce glucose and oxygen. The glucose is converted in some plants and stored as starch. This experiment will take you through steps to determine if light is really needed for photosynthesis. If light is needed, then the covered area of a leaf will not return a positive test for starch. Please follow the steps in the experiment to reach a conclusion. Section B. Black covering prevents sunlight from reaching that part of a leaf. Leaf covered for 6 hours. Section C. Leaf immersed in boiling water for 10 minutes, then removed and placed in boiling tube. Bunsen burner provides the flame. Section D. Boiling tube containing leaf and ethanol placed in a hot water bath. No flame is used for this section. Ethanol removes chlorophyll from the leaf, leaving the leaf crispy and with a lighter color. Section E. Leaf immersed in water after removing from the ethanol. Leaf becomes soft again. Section F. Iodine added to the leaf. The portion that was covered with black took the color of the iodine. The rest of the leaf changed to blue-black. Blue-black indicates a positive test for starch. In this experiment, the area that was covered did not return a positive test for starch. Let me take you through the experiment a little slower. So in A, we have a leaf that, of course, is carrying out the process of photosynthesis. And there we have chlorophyll trapping the light energy from the sun. In B, the said leaf is covered with a block piece of paper. And, of course, firmly secured. In C, the leaf is detached and placed in a beaker with boiling water. Here we have the beaker tripod stand and Bunsen burner. In section D, the leaf is placed in a boiling tube with ethanol and the boiling tube with ethanol is placed in a hot water bath. This is done because water boils at 100 degrees Celsius while ethanol would boil somewhere about 78 degrees Celsius. Hence, the flame is not required here or that could lead to an accident in the experiment. So at section D, the flame should be put out in your experiment. We also observe in section D that the ethanol did remove some amount of chlorophyll from the leaf. This left the leaf with a pale green color. It was also observed that the leaf was very crispy having been removed from the ethanol. However, the leaf was again placed in water and this water softened the leaf and of course we were able to apply iodine thereafter on a white tile. The area that was covered with the paper did not return a positive test for starch. Instead, it took the color of the iodine, red-brown while the other portion of the leaf that was exposed to light returned a positive test for starch. This indicates that the area that was covered required light in order for photosynthesis to take place. As such, there was no starch in this part of the leaf. Another video would be published to determine if chlorophyll is needed for photosynthesis. Remember to like, share and subscribe to my channel. Thanks much for watching.